Fabulous day for Eritrea because you've won the African Champions and Championship, you're not African champion. And also Bini. Bini, see. Bini just won getting well for Gum. Yeah. Amazing, yeah. amazing really effort. Amazing. And it goes to show the versatility of Eritrean riders now. You know, if you guys can sprint, you can climb, you can do everything. Starring at Zeni, Vidi, Bini. More history is made. Eritrea is the winner of the Grand Tour stage. African men's road race champion. Enoch, you know, how are you doing? I'm fine. Yeah? Yeah. Sir. Great race yesterday. Welcome to the 2022 African Cycling Championships Road Race in Sharm El Sheikh, Egypt on Sunday 27th March. The hosts Egypt were out in force alongside prominent cycling nations like South Africa, Eritrea, Rwanda and Algeria. Riders were helped along on the way out by a 29 km per hour tailwind. Enoch had a welcoming party of Eritreans waiting to embrace him at the finish. This was his party and he did not disappoint as he powered through the middle to take a popular win. I'm here with the newly crowned African men's road race champion. Enoch, how are you doing? I'm fine. Yeah? Yeah, sir. Great race yesterday. Thank you. Um, very tough race. I was there. I felt <laughs> I yeah. felt it. In the end, there was a... I think it took about two hours for the break to establish. And then it was like a 12, 13 man break, which you were in. And then the split happened near the end, I think, Algeria. Yeah, the last It went the really lap, hard and you lost lap, some yeah. of your teammates on the last lap. See. Um, because of the crosswinds, they put you guys in the gutter. Yeah. Great move by them. Yes. But you still delivered, you know? Yeah. And yeah. um, what was going through? What were you thinking with like 1k to go? Yeah, uh, you're right. It's, uh, when they split, it's uh, yeah. a tough moment. You saw it's a uh, really, really hard crosswind yeah. and there was a. Uh, five uh, riders of Algeria, it was a great move, yeah. but me, I was uh, really confident with this uh, leg, you know, yeah. but I came in the right position. Uh, honestly, I'm afraid in the last uh, 1K because uh, there are five riders, they will attack something like this, then yeah. when I see 500 meters, it's about sprint, not about attack, you know. Yeah, um, so I noticed you took the inside lane rather than the outside lane. Why, why did you make that decision? Yeah. I know it's a shorter lane, but some people would say the wind was blowing yeah, yeah, yeah. across. Yes, but because when uh, I saw 500 meters, I sit in the back of wheel of the South Africa. Yeah. I was in the last, everybody say I will not sprint, then I will go back. Then I see the guys of Algeria, they go right, and it's very hard to go mm -hmm. to right. Then yeah. When I see 400, 300 meter, I think I go directly into the Algeria in the middle. Yeah. I want to split the guys. The then guys. They split. They yeah. say they are nervous. They start the sprint. Then the. So they started start. early and yeah. then okay. Fantastic. Not early. They start in the right time. Oh, the right but time. They didn't put us in the right position. Oh, you know? okay. I had so good legs. Yeah. I come by left nice. and we go in the in the middle. Fantastic, fantastic. Now, before the start of the race, um, was that the game plan? Was the game plan to have you in a, to deliver you for a sprint, or was the game plan to um, to cause a split and try and get into a small break? No, no, uh, confidently for a sprint. You guys were going for a sprint. Yeah, yeah. You see, that's been very interesting because a lot of people were saying that Eritrea were going to try and create to split because you didn't want to, you know, go into the sprint. Yeah, 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 yeah I'm a sprinter. Uh, well, there you go, and obviously, you know, a, a fabulous day for Eritrea because you've won the African Champions and Championship, you're now the African Champion, and also Bini. Bini, see. Bini just won getting well for Gum. Yeah. Amazing, yeah, I'm amazing really effort. Amazing. And it goes to show the versatility of Eritrean riders now. You know, if you guys can sprint, you can climb, you can do everything. Yeah. That's fantastic news. Um, I just want to say, finally, in terms of like, What's next for you? I know you are with Bike Aid, but not anymore. Um, you've moved on. 
Um, what's the plan for you this year? Are any teams coming for you? And if not, what, where do you want to be? Yeah, as you know, last year I had a really, really bad moment in the November and December. I don't want to remember now. Yeah. I honestly, I want to stop cycling in that moment. Okay. It's a really, really shit moment with my brain. I know all the day I don't sleep in this moment. So you because, suffered a bit of depression, yeah? Yeah, yeah because yeah. I had really, really, really to go in the profession. I had, I, I, I did already plan for the race, for the world to race. Right. And when you hear this, it's, uh, mm. it's incredible for me, for the brains, like uh, boom, you know. But after, I say to myself, you can do it again, I said. Then yeah. I go again with bike it, uh, to start season in Antalya, Rwanda, mm. then here, Champion Africa. Now yeah. I had some offer. So sorry to cut you off. Just before you, you were saying, so you were with um, um, MTM Quebec, um, no, MTM. Asos. Asos, yeah. Yeah, Asos Quebec. 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 Yeah, um, World Tour team, and obviously because you know they 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 stepped down um, into a pro quantity. Um, no pro quantity. Sorry, Continental. Quite intercontinental. Um, obviously, as a rider, that that was a you know a, a huge deal because it meant that you know. They had to get rid of some riders as well, isn't it? Yeah. So you end up stepping down to bike aid, um, and that was a difficult moment for you because you always want to be well tall. I get, yeah. I understand yeah. that. Okay. So now you've won this. What's the what's the plan? Yeah, I had really good uh, conversation. Not me. My agent is really. I'm really confident on him. Okay. So, uh, soon I hopefully I will come back in the peloton with the world tour because. Now I want to race in the world tour, you know. Yeah. I want to show something in the world to race, you know. Yeah. So fantastic. Um, and can you speak about it or is it no, right? No. Because it's not. Uh, it's option, not confirmed you know? yet. Yeah, it's not confirmed. So I have to okay. Is uh, what country is the, is the team in? I don't know. It's, it's, uh, it's your agent Eritrean yeah. or is it Patrick from no, Lantern Rouge? No, he's from Italy. It's, it's, so it's it, it, Italian uh, agent? Yeah. And is he Italian Eritrean or just Italian? No, just Italian. Okay. Next career. Oh, okay. Okay, fantastic. Yeah. So, in, in terms of where you want to be next then, you want to be well taught? Yeah. Is there any preference for you? Do you have any preference of where you want to be? So, if you can, in the ideal scenario, a team, well taught team that you'd like to ride with in the future? Honestly, I don't think about this before, but yeah. if any team I go, I, I would be happy, you know. Me, I just, any team is any team, you know. Yeah. So it's, it depends on your legs, and uh, you're right, some teams is uh, switch for you, and some teams not, but for me, for everyone, every time I just yeah. switch for everything, I think so. Fantastic. Well, we better be going because you have a meeting um, with, with your team. Yeah. I just want to say thank you so much for the thank interview. So Congrats, champion. Thank you. And I hope those of you out there, um, you'll be looking at this man in the future. Yeah. Because we've got Benny, I'm now winning, and there's more riders coming through, and even junior riders coming through. It's a, it's a huge, um, what's the word? A huge compliment to Eritrean Cycling and Team Eritrea. You guys come here, there's a big community here. Um, as a, a big team come here to ride today um, at, at the African Champs and on top of that you've got journalists also at, in the part, in, in, as part of the crew which is fantastic to see because you guys are doing what most you, you're setting the standard for, for Africa and for um, um, African countries you know they should be everyone should be trying to emulate what you guys are doing because you're doing it the right way and you're producing champions as a result yeah. so Fantastic job, my friend. Thank well you. done. Thank All you. the best for the future. Thank you.